I'm singing a song waiting for the YouTube and the Facebook to catch up and you to come in. Yeah. Hi, it's Evita and uh, it's Wednesday. Today is July 22nd, uh, still in New York City, um, self-quarantining in the apartment. It's great. It's hot. Uh, <laughs> let's give Michael Jagger a call and let's see if he will come play with us because uh, we're going to do some dancing today, everybody. Oh my gosh. Hi, Chiren. You're back. Good to see you. Well, see you. Isn't that a funny thing now? Alrighty, let's see here. We're waiting. I think that is the Michael. Hold on. We're going to flip over and do a double screen and bring on in the Michael. The Michael. Hi, Michael. Can you hear me okay? The Michael. I can. Can you hear me? Yeah, you look great. Thanks. So do you. You put on, so you, you gussy up, you got all gussied up for no reason. Well, you know, nowadays, lipstick, brushing your hair, and earrings, that's all that matters. <laughs> that's my, that's always been my motto. Hi. Oh, Isa's there. Hey, Isa. And Cheren is there. Hello, Cheren. Hey, Cheren. So, um, hello, if you're, if you're tuning in or if you're watching, please say hello. Uh, you might be on our YouTube channel or you might be on the Facebook. And uh, either way, we're excited to play with you all today. Um, what are we going to do today, Michael? Well, that's a great question. I think, first of all, we're going to do some movement. We're going to do a little dancing. Have you heard of that before? Not in a Would long like time. To... Oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> um, no, it's, uh, yeah, we, well, uh, in full disclosure, you and I were chatting uh, last week about what we were going to do. And you were like, what if we do some variations on the Shim Shim? And I was like, that sounds really cool. And then I thought to myself, I don't know if I know any. So I made some up, and I think they're going to be pretty fun. I, I, I'm i really excited, I because not only do I get to share what I came up with, but I get to learn your steps. Oh, man. Oh, man. <laughs> no, it'll be good. Yeah, I'm, I'm really excited to see what you got, uh, because I think it'll, uh, yeah, I just, I don't know. I have no idea how your brain works, and yet I have a sense of it, so I'm, I know it's going to be fun. You probably know more how my brain works than I know myself, Michael. I, I, that's probably You know what? True. I'm going to do something. Um, no, um, but I thought it was really, I think it's a really cool idea that you put up. Uh, yes, just, do you need something? Oh, I, I think I should turn off my fan and my air conditioner, uh, although I will <laughs> melt in about five minutes. But you guys let me know if it even makes a difference. Uh, but I'm going to turn off my fan and air conditioner. Okay, while you do that, I'm going to give a little bit of history on the Shim Sham, if that's all right. Um, so the Shim Sham uh, was created by, or it's accredited to two tap dancers by the name of Willie Bryant and Leonard Reed. Um, and, uh, and it's really important, first of all, to the Lindy Hop community, because uh, the last few years we've been, uh, as we've been traveling around, when we ask students that question in class, uh, more often than not, we'll get an answer about Frankie Manning being attributed to that. But actually, it was two tap dancers uh, that that created the Shim Sham. Um, they were when they created it, um, they were on they were part of a traveling company with the Whitman sisters, um, and the Whitman sisters um, were a part of um, part of a, a, a circuit in vaudeville called Toba or T O B A which was the theater owners booking association. And it was created for, um, for black and African-American performers to, uh, to have a theater circuit to go to since it was still very much a segregated, um, segregated country uh, under Jim Crow laws. So the Whitman sisters, there were four of them and, uh, and it was really, they were around from 1900 to 1944 or 45. And it was really an important company for a lot of uh, dancers and performers, uh, singers, comedians to get their break um, in show business. And, uh, and so Leonard Reed and Willie Bryant were a part of this, this company. And uh, when they were doing, when they did the Shim Sham, they used to call it Goofus, apparently. So it wasn't actually called the Shim Sham originally. It was called Goofus. Um, and I just learned this past week from uh, taking an online class with Monsal Durden that the original song the Shim Sham was danced to was called um, Turkey in the Straw. Now, if you've never heard that song, um, that makes sense. Uh, yeah, I bet you've heard the song because the song uh, is actually... Uh, to many people, it's the the ice cream truck song, 
or I, I, I learned it in, in grade school as uh, do your ears hang low? Do they wobble to and fro? Can you tie them in a nut? Can you tie them in a bow? Can you throw them off your shoulder like a continental soldier? Do, 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 do your ears hang low? Something like that. So there you go. You're welcome, everybody. A little bit of singing and dancing tonight. But, um, but uh, actually, that was the original song. And, and, and uh, the song. Yeah, I, so um, you can uh, definitely on Spotify look up Turkey in the Straw, and when you hear it, you'll be like, oh, yeah, of course I know the song. Where he goes, at least according to Willie Bryant, I'm sorry, according to Leonard Reed in the book, what he says is that uh, Pops Whitman, who was uh, one of the sons of the Whitman sisters, um, he was dancing uh, at one point with a little boy, and that little boy went to New York uh, and took the shim sham with him. And the way that the, the boy did the shim sham was with a lot of shimmying. And thus, Goofus became the Shim Sham Shimmy. Oh, so, wow. Yeah. So. That's really cool, Michael. You know, also, um, jumping back really quick to that particular song, the um, I, I, again, it's called the Turkey... Turkey in the Straw. Yeah. Turkey in the Straw. Uh, it, it, it's an uncomfortable song because it has mm. so many connections to that sort of minstrel era. So it's it's a really kind of icky yeah. song that you know like it seems it seems harmless and and childlike but if you know the roots of it it's kind of a song yes you can look it up but we don't really want to use it in this day and age right yeah the insidious uh in monsell's talk from his class um which was talking about uh tropes uh some of the racist tropes um he said that uh watermelon uh, was sometimes known or referred to as um, coon ice cream. And I was like, oh, so the fact that ice cream trucks use that song is really, it's, it was, it's a dark, like you said, it's really dark. But, and it's, it's also good for people to know that. So, yeah, yeah. Well, um, yeah. so moving into, uh, mo moving into our modern day Lindy Hop community, um, Frankie Manning really, he kind of made sort of a ritual of doing the shim sham at the end of, or sometimes in the middle of a swing dance. And, um, and it's, it's, it, it's a really nice tradition that we want to hold on to. And, uh, you know, it's still a great line dance and it's still got a rich history with the tap dance uh, community connecting to the swing dance community. So do you want to take it uh, one step at a time? We've got the shim sham step, yeah? Oh, you want to, yeah, you want to trade steps? I do want to trade steps. Cool. <laughs> all right. Um, all righty. So let's see. Well, I'll keep it. I'll keep it in this frame where you can see the the two of us real quick before we get into the steps. Hi Q. Hi James. Hi Ron. Hi Terry and Eileen. Hi Nancy. Uh, Who am I missing? <laughs> Anyways, if you're if you're out there, uh, hi Mateo. If you're um if you're out there, you guys say say hello and we'll we'll be back in to check on the comments if you have any questions about stuff. Okay, uh, so the shim sham step, which we probably all uh, have done already, and that's basically the single, the single, and the double it up, and we start on mm -hmm. count eight. So five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, a three, four, a five, six, seven. Instead of that stomp slide. I would like to offer making it a little kick, like you flick your foot. So again, we're going to go uh, on count eight, eight and one, two and three, four and five, six, seven. So instead of a double kick, what I did there is I kicked my foot out and I crossed it, I kicked it out and brought it back, which satisfies the same amount of time. So a five, yeah. six, seven, eight, a one, two, a three, four, you cross out. Eight, a one, two, a three, four, a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, a three, four, a five, six, seven. Yeah, I'll do it once facing you guys. You can try it with me and then we'll see Michael's step. And okay. a five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, cross it over, kick a step, kick step, and cross over. Eight, a one, two, a three, four, a five, six, seven. I'm just gonna tap my foot because we're gonna get ready to go into a break step. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's cool, I like that, I like it's that a lot. It's easy, it's easy, it's, it's good simple. for shimmying. I like the cross, it's simple, the hook. but it gives you a lot of chance for style. I think that's really cool. <laughs> um, right then, I, uh, I'm gonna back up and I'm gonna say this, Evita, just between you and me, so 
everyone else, you don't have to listen to this. The delay in the video just between us is amazingly crazy Oh dear. in a way that I'm like, oh. so uh, I'm excited because I was learning your step in the chair, but I was about 10 seconds behind you and it's all good. That's okay. Yeah, people, it's fine. People at right. home, they're, so they'll, they're is, smart. Can, they'll figure it out. Can you see me? Yeah, yeah I'm not worried. Yes, not worried. I would say, Michael, back up a little bit so we see your feet. Yeah, I'm going to have my producer tilt the, the camera just a little bit more down. Is that better? You look great. Yes. All right, go on. All right, so um, what I'm going to do for my single, single, double, or my shim shim variation is I'm going to do a little toe heel. So I'm going to turn around just so we can see uh, first from the back because I know that's how we like to learn. Uh, I'm going to put my weight uh, in the ball of my foot on the left and on the heel of the right so that, um, so that this is the freedom that happens. So I'm going to start by going eight, one, and then I'm going to switch to the ball of my right, the heel of my left, eight, two, and then switch, two. So we're just doing this, um, this gesture or this movement. If you've never done this before, you've never spent enough time alone. Um, this is, um, it's just really alternating between one toe and one heel of the opposite foot so that the opposite toe and heel can pivot. So this is what we're doing as our gesture. And we're gonna do that in the pattern of the shim sham. So starting on count eight, we're gonna kick the right toe and the left heel to our right side. A five, six, seven, eh, eh, oh, eh, 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 double up on the right. And then we're gonna repeat that on the left. Left, mm, right, mm, two times on the left and right, mm, and left, mm, and two times on the right break. So we're gonna still keep that break on eight, stepping forward with the right foot. One more time, play with me. Um, we're gonna do right, left, right, and here we go. Hey, a ho, a here we go. A -a 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 double up on the right. We go the left, then the right, double up on the left, and then the right, and then the left, double up on the right break. I love One time it. Facing. I, I love like it. You. you look great. You almost look like you're a part of the Rhythm Nation right there. That's cool. Ah! All right. <laughs> one more time. It's a whole That's other shim sham. I All love right, I'm that. I'm going to do that facing the camera one time. <laughs> uh, play along with me, and then we'll, uh, I think we'll learn a break step. Uh, hey, a uh, ho, uh, here we go. Uh, and one, uh, uh, double up to the right. You go the left, then the right. You double up on the left. You go the right, then the left. Double up on the right break. That's great, Michael. I love it. Cool. I, I think since we're already here, do you want to go ahead and give us your break step? Yeah, sure. Why not? All right. So this break step, super simple. Uh, it's uh, it's inspired by one of uh, one of the Brat Pack dancers. So one of the one of the dancers that uh, we teach, uh, Mo and I work with in here in London. Uh, his name is Dave Savage. He's also my Rocket League buddy. I put it out there on, <laughs> on film. Um, he does a, he, did, he created a little step, and I took inspiration from that for this break. So what we're going to do is we're going to step forward on the right, as we said. We're going to go step, touch behind with the left, a triple step back on the left. A five, six, seven, step, touch, triple step. Five, six, seven, step, touch, triple step, touch, step touch step so Ooh, i love it yeah. it's just a little moment after you stepped forward uh with your right foot for the break step touch behind you're gonna go triple step and then touch your right to your left touch shift over to your right foot and then bring the left foot in to touch and then step oh that's very sassy person, if you like numbers it it goes something like this Two and three, four, five, six, seven. Uh, seven. Yeah, if you don't try like it again, Michael. Try like it again. Words, it goes like this: a five, six, seven, step, touch, triple step, touch, step, touch, step. I think I got it. I think I got it. One more time, maybe facing us. Okay. Hey, ho! A here we go. A step, touch, triple step, touch, step. Touch step. Super. Why yeah. don't we connect your first shim sham step with the break and then we'll switch over to my break step? 
Sweet. I love it. It sounds great. I'm just for the sake of people following at home. I'm going to, I'm going to turn my back to you so you can do that. All right. Toe heel it. Ready. Hey, ho, here we go. Uh, eh, oh, uh, uh, uh. You double up on the right to the left, to the right. You double up on the left. You go the right, the left, double up on the right. Step, tap, triple step. Touch, step, touch, step. That was super fast, and I'm so sorry. Was that too fast? I, I really I really enjoyed it, but yeah, let's do it one more time gently. <laughs> so, I was so excited. My apologies. I, I, had, a, I had a great ho. time with it, though. Thanks. Hey, ho, uh, here we go. To the right, to the left, double up on the right. To the left, to the right, double up on the left. To the right, to the left. Double up on the right, break, touch, triple step, touch, step, touch, step. That's great, Michael. I, th I think that was a huge success. Oh, thanks. Oh, man. So what do you got? Uh, I'm going to bring it back over here. I'm going to switch the screen up so that I believe, oh, you're seeing me large. And we've got Michael in the small corner there. Um, alrighty, so my break step, uh, I'm going to face the back here. We're still going to break like always on our right foot on count eight. And I'm still going to do a tap with my left toe. That's on one. Then I'm going to kick my left foot on two and use it to swing my left hip over two and cross on three. So the left foot is crossed over. On count four, I'm going to turn all the way around, four, and a five, I'm going to go right, left, like I, you know, get out of the step, a five. You can snap or clap on six if you feel like it, and then come back, and seven. And we're ready for eight, whatever the next thing might be. So let's try that slowly. The break is going to go eight, tap, one, kick, two, Cross three, turn four, uh, five, snap six, and seven. One, once again, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, a uh, five, six, a uh, seven. A couple of things that I do that might help you out. When you take your step on count eight for the tap, like a normal shim sham break, Instead of going so far forward for it, think about count eight as actually going around. So you're already getting this turn prepped in your body. My right toe and my right knee is actually going to turn eight, one, two, three. So the entire step, toe, kick, cross, I'm already allowing the body to begin that turn. That way, on count four, I don't have such a long way to get around. So let's try that thinking about prepping the turn as soon as possible. Five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, three, four, a five, six, and seven. And again, when I come out of the turn, I'm choosing to step right, left, right, left, so that my right foot will be ready for the next idea. Let's do That's it cool. like two more times. Yeah, two yeah. more times. Six, a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, three, four, a five, six, and seven. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Try to chain them all together like one idea instead of multiple parts. Slowly. A five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, a five, six, and seven. A five, mm -hmm. a six, a five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, hoo hoo, hoo hoo hoo. So maybe if you remember my shim sham step, which was just a kick it out, kick it out, kick, cross, step. Kick it out, kick it out, kick, cross, step. Kick it out, kick it out, kick, cross, touch, eight, one, two, three, four, a five, six, a seven. Yeah, let's do that, uh, those two steps together. A five. Yeah, yeah. A little slower. <laughs> yeah, yeah, a five, yeah, yeah. A six, 
A five, six, seven. Kick it out, kick it out, kick cross out. A kick it out, kick it out, kick across out. Kick it out, kick it out, kick cross top. Eight, one, two, three, four, a five, a six, seven, eight. Again, last time. Five, a six, a five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, five, six, seven, eight. Get ready for the break. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, a five, a seven. Oh, that time I turned too fast. <laughs> So uh, there's a break step for us to play with. Uh, checking in. Oh my gosh, hi Natasha. Good to see you. And we've got Owen. Uh, thank you, Owen, for helping out Claudia with the subtitles toggle. Oh, yeah, thank you. Thank you. Um, I guess if there's no questions, do we want to look at the next step in the Shim Sham? Can do. We can do. I was trying to also uh, double up on the on the check in the chat and it's a uh, it's crazy it's a lot of work um it yeah, is I'm, I'm i happy. can let me let me keep the camera where we are and let me go into pushes right pushes yeah. would be the next step that we did so we just went with our right leg a uh, five six and seven eight on count eight let's start pushing to the right eight a oh, one two a uh, three four. I'm going to kick my left leg on seven and I want to turn again. Whoops. Eight, a one, two, and three, four, five, six, seven. Now think of that turn as just a half of a turn. I don't want you to worry about getting so far around and so fast. Eight and one, two, pushing, four, uh, eight, a one, two, a three, kick on four, cross over on five, turn like halfway on six because you still have count seven to rebound and go back the other way. Let's try it to the left. So we've got eight, a one, two, and three, four, cross over five, turning gently six. You still have the rebound on seven. Going back, eight and one, two, and three, four, a uh huh, mm, mm. You go what? I'm so sorry, guys. I think I gave you the wrong number on the kick. Eight, a one, two, and three, four. I'm sorry, kick on five, six, seven, Yay. eight, a one. Cool. Okay. Thank you. Four, a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, and three, four, and five, six, seven. This is the quick one. Eight, one, two, three, and then we're going to have one last turn that is slow. Four, five, take all the time that you want, six, seven, all the way until and eight for our Tachyanis. Mm. So let me do that all again. We're still just going cool. through our regular pushes. All I want you to do is kick around and then let that leg start to turn you. And the big deal about this I'm trying to, to get us to absorb is that it doesn't have to come to the front so quickly. Use count seven as like a rock step falling out of the turn that is the motivation to push you back into the other direction. Let's go slow oh. from the beginning of pushes. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, a three, four, a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, a three, four, a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, a three, four, a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, three, four, five. Take your time, six, seven, and eight. Yeah? Cool. Yeah, it's cool. One more time. And five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, three. Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Duh. Oh. Uh -huh. <laughs> yeah. So, something about this that I'm enjoying, or I think is challenging, and I'm enjoying playing with it, is my ability to stretch out as much time or use as much space and time as I have 
but of course still make it to the beat on time. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, yeah that's cool. That's really cool. And I think what's nice about that, for me at least, as I was playing with us, I forgot to do a turn, but it doesn't mess up where I am in the thing. So if I left out a turn, I can still keep going with my regular pushes. That's a super great bit of advice there, Michael. Just made me feel good about myself, that's all. <laughs> but you're welcome, everybody. So uh, cool. what do you, what's your idea or variation on the pushes step? Oh, man. Well, the good news is that we're not turning. The better news is that there's more percussive rhythms. So here's what we're going to do. Um, we're going to do a little heel toe, but it's a different kind of heel toe than what we did last time because we're not pivoting. So with my right foot, I'm going to begin by going heel, heel, which is right, left. So I'm going to go right, left, and then step back, toe, toe. Hey, heel, Michael. Heel, toe, toe. That's me. Can you move back further because we can't see your toes? Oh, my gosh. Yes, please. And that's, that's kind of important. <laughs> yes, I can see it now. Help. My apologies. Okay, so um, one more time, just for, uh, for, for my feet sake, I'm starting with my right foot and I'm going heel, heel, and then stepping back, toe, toe, heel, heel, toe, toe, eh, uh, uh, eh, 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 uh. So that's the, that's the weight shifts that we're doing as, uh, as well as the rhythm. Uh, eh, 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 yes. And we're gonna do this again on count eight for you numbers people. Five, six, seven, and eight, and one, and two, and three, and four. Now, right there, what I did is I stepped forward with the right foot, but then I scuff with the left. So you're just going to make a little strike that you don't have to. It can just be a kick. But if you're, uh, if you're interested in the percussive nature of it, I'm going to make a sound and four like that. I'm going to push up because I'm going to go and four and five. And I'm going to cross my left in front of my right and then slide to the side. So this is what that whole shape looks like. It sounds like this, five, six, seven. Eh, eh, ah, ooh, ah, 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 ooh, ooh, ah, ah, ooh, ah. Oh, With I words, like that at the end. A five, six, seven, heel, heel, toe, toe, heel, heel, toe, toe, step, scuff, hop, step, and then slide. So as I do the scuff, when I go step, scuff, hop, cross, that would be the words I use. Step, scuff, hop, cross, and then step out with the right foot for the slide illusion. And that is, if you like numbers, and four and five is when we cross, and then we slide out on six, seven. That whole idea of five, six, a five, six, seven, and eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five. Cross it out. Yes? That's beautiful. I'm pushing that slide, so I'm not going six. I'm actually sliding out on and five, and. So I, I slide a little bit sooner. The cross is still on five. The scuff with the left foot is still on four. Let's do that again for my brain. A five, six, a five, six seven and eight and one and two and three and four and five and a seven did that work for you vita i love it i love it go on then um <laughs> let's do that one more time um uh i'm going to scat us in and i'm not going to use counts this time hey ho uh, here we go heel heel toe toe heel heel toe toe and step, scuff, cross, slide, da oh. oh. And are we going to reverse it on the other side? Yeah, that's the next trick. You want to reverse it right away? Let's do it. I mean, I'm ready. So, okay. <laughs> so, same idea with the left foot now. We're going to go heel, heel, toe, toe. Heel, heel, toe, toe. Step, scuff, hop, cross. Slide it out. Do that again for your body and your brain. Five, six, seven, heel, heel, toe, toe, heel, heel, toe, toe, scuff, scuff, hop, step, slide it out. A little bit faster. Ho, I uh, here we go. Ba da, ba do, ba di, ba do, ba hoo, ba oo, ah. 
so pretty. Thanks. You want to try the right side and then the left side? And then the right side again? Oh, since we're here, we might as well do the right side again. That's the, <laughs> yeah. that's the pattern. All right, starting with the right foot on eight, heel, heel to toe. Hey, ho, uh, here we go. Ada, ba do, ba da, ba do, ba boo, ba oo, ah, the left, the do, da oo, ba di, da oo, ba oo, ba oo, ah, the right, ba ah, 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 ba boo, ba oo, ha, na do. Yes, did that work? Yeah, I love it. Let's do it one more time. And then we'll add on that last little bit of pushes as an idea. Hey, ho, here we go. Heel, heel, toe, toe. Heel, heel, toe, toe. Stop, scot, hop, cross, side it out. Left foot, da, da, ba, do, da, da. Oh, 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 da, da, ba, do, ba, do. Ah, 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 ah. Yes? I love it. Yeah, so I think from there, just like in the pushes pattern, when we get to the end of the, the pushes, which is the, the fourth um, eight count, we, we just kind of, we don't do the doubling it up before we do the cross. And it's going to be the same idea here. So what that means is that we've just gone uh, the last time on the right foot. Ba-da, ba-do, ba-da, ba-do, ba-ha, ba-oh, ah, ba -ha. yeah. Mm -hmm. mm. So we're just going to really, you're going to step with your left. Step, ska, ha, boom, ba, ah, 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 oh, ah. So we're, we're just taking out the heel, heel toe, toe moment as we do this. I'm going to have to, Evita, I'm going to confess, I have to go back to my counts to, to get the timing for myself. That's so this okay. last, the last time of the regular uh, pattern before we mix it up, five, six, seven, and eight, and one, and two, and three, and four, and five, six, and seven, and eight, and one, two, and three, and four, and five, two. But uh, so for me, I'm, I'm looking for that scuff to be on the on the four and the eight. And what that means about my life is that I go and eight and one and two and three and four and five, six and seven and eight and one, two, a three, a four, a five, six and seven and eight. So we have a we just we go uh, that last here. Uh, 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 ooh, uh, 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 oh. Yes, I'm with no, you. I'm I'm totally with you. And you know when I did it, Michael, uh, I actually just happened to stomp off left right, which I'm not too okay. I'm not too angry about that because if you make that right foot just a tap, then you're ready for tachyani. Absolutely, that's a. That's a great observation. There's some flexibility in that moment. A little, a little wiggle room, a little cheat area. Well, let's yes? try this. Let's try this whole variation as a as a phrase. I love it. You ready? I'm ready. Hey, ho! Uh, here we go. Ada ba do ba da ba do ba oo 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 ah ba do a two a two a three a four a five six and seven and eight a three two a three a four a five six and seven and eight and one two a three a four a five six and seven and eight. Yeah. And that stomp off on and eight, like you said, it is a stomp off on eight, and it can go with either foot, but we we want that that right foot free to do our tacky any variation in just a second. I like it, Michael. Okay, so I would Oops. I would say there's no break that happens after these pushes because we go straight into tachyanis, right? That is correct. All right. You want to keep going with your tachyani since we're on you and oh, we yeah. can practice the transition in? That sounds fabulous. Thank you. This will be easy because it, it's built around a triple step, which we should all be able to do already. So we're going to do a triple step. Uh, starting with our right foot, stepping behind ourselves. One, a two, three, a four, five, a six, seven, and eight. So we're stepping behind with the right, and that's the beginning of our triple step, and that's on count one. So five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, a four, five, a six, 
seven, and eight. And then we do that two more times. Two, a uh, two, three, a uh, four, five, a uh, six, seven, and eight. Three, a uh, two, three, a uh, four, five, a uh, six, seven. Into our break. Right there we go. Oh, yeah, I remember that break. Yeah, it was a long time ago. It was the only, <laughs> I, th I think that should be fairly straightforward for everybody. The one little note about, I don't know if it's styling, but it is a choice that I'm making. Um, and I'll offer that up if you see it and you want to do the same thing. Um, when I do the transition, triple step, triple step, triple step, step. It is a triple step, but from when I step behind with the, with the left foot on seven, seven, instead of going and eight, which you could do, which is what we had been doing, from here, I'm gonna treat that like a stomp off to the front. So from that seven and eight, and then I'll start it again. It doesn't mean you have to do it, it's just something that I felt like giving it a, a, a clear distinction from just doing triple steps behind ourselves uh, and where that stomp off kind of puts a little bookmark in between each moment. Yeah, that, that sounds good. It helps us to keep our place in the music. And then also, of course, by the end of the phrase, before the break comes, you cross the left foot behind you and then be prepared to step into eight for the break. Exactly. And that break it again was step, was toe, step, trip. Tap, trip, toe, step, touch, step, touch, step. Sounds great. Okay, so this is asking a lot of everybody watching, but I think we can do it. Can we do Michael's variation on the pushes and his tachiani into his break step? It's three big step ideas. I think we can do it. I'm excited. I'm going to try it. <laughs> here we go. I'm, yeah. Hey, ho, a here we go. And eight, and one, a two, a three, a four, a five, six, a seven, and eight, a two, a two, Oh, I messed it up. And through the do, I did that. Triple step, triple step, triple step. Stomp off. Triple step, triple step, triple step. Step, stomp off. Three, two, three, a four, five, a six. Break. Step, tap, triple step, touch, step, touch, step. I think we survived, but just barely. I barely survived it, if I'm honest with you. Can I do it again for me? Yeah, 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 yeah. What foot does it start on? Is it right, left? It is right, left. That's correct. Because, right. And the reason that it starts right, left, just for, for our sense of brains, what came right before this pushes variation was the break step. And the break step, again, is step, touch, triple step, touch, step, touch, step. So you should be on your left to go and eight and one, a uh, two, a uh, three. Does that make sense? Yeah. So that's how that. I'm with you. I'm with you. All right. Let's try it all again from there. From the heel, heel, toe, toe, starting with the right foot. Hey, ho, here we go. And eight, a one, a two, a three, a four, a five, six, a seven, and eight, and two, a two, a three, a four, a five, six, and seven, and eight, and three, a two, a three, a four, a five, six, and seven, and eight, and two. And then from here, I messed it up, sorry. And eight, two, uh, Michael, do it again for me, Evita, I'm sorry, I got into my own brain. That's my okay, it's hot. Watching at home. Or you probably did the same thing as me. Hey, ho, push this variation. We go. Dee dee, a do, a do, a do, ha, a, a, o, a. Ho, do, a two, a two, a three, a four, a five, six, and seven, and eight, a three, two, three, a four, a five, six, and seven, and eight, and one, two, a three, a four, a five, six, and seven, and eight. Triple step, triple step, triple step. Ho, stomp off and triple step, triple step. Triple step, step, stomp off, triple step, triple step, trip, break, step, eight, tap, triple step, touch, step, touch, step. 
We did it that time. We did it. We did it. We did it. By the by the skin of our teeth. <laughs> That's great. No <laughs> can we try, worries. Mm -hmm. Can we try yours uh, from the from from your pushes variation, please? Yes, absolutely. Um, okay, so review my pushes for everybody. That's the one with the turn, and then I'll teach you my variation on the tack annie. Oh, we haven't learned yours. That's why I don't know it. Good. That's why we don't know it yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, my apologies. So, Let's do that then. <laughs> Michael was like, my brain hurts. Okay. Brain. Um, just a quick review. My pushes, everybody, was a lot of turning. Eight, a one, two, a three, four, a five, six. Rebound. Eight, a one, two, a three, four, a five, six. Rebound. Eight, a one, two, a three, four. A lot of turning coming up. And a one, two, three four, five, six, seven, and eight. We're ready for Tachiani. My variation is pretty fun and easy, I think. Uh, we're gonna do two uh, beats of the Tachiani with the right foot going back and then the left foot going back. So that was one, two, three, four. You're still in a wide position. I want you to crawl your toes in, then your heels in, then your toes in so you're standing with your feet together and then stomp off out again, and eight, so we can repeat the whole thing. We have tachyani on the right, tachyani on the left, and toe, heel, toe, stomp off. Tacky right, tacky left, and toe, heel, toe. A one, two, a three, four, a ooh, 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 a ha, ba, ba, do, ba, ba, toe, heel, toe, stomp off. So as soon as you finish toe, heel, toe, see if you can position a little bit of your weight onto the left side so that you can quickly and immediately go stomp off right, left. So you can do it cool. again. Yep, yep, yep. Cool. Let's try that three in a row. Five, a six, a five, six, seven, and eight, a one, two, three, four, toe, heel, toe, and eight, a one, two, three, four, toe, heel, toe, and eight, a one, two, three, four, toe, heel, toe. Now let's review my break. Remember, we're going to think of turning to our right from the onset. Eight, one, two, three, four, a five, six, a seven. Whoa. Let's try hmm. that all together. So we're, oh gosh. Slowly, I'll go slowly, I promise. But can we do my pushes with the turns? Can we do the tack annies with the toe heel crawl into my break step? We try. We try. Here we go. I'm so excited. Here we go. <laughs> nice and easy. We've got a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, three, four, a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, three, four, five, six, keep going, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, a one, two, three, toe heel, e, 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 ba, 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 one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight, a one, two, three, four, break, coming up. Eight, one, two, three, four, a five, six, and seven. Yep, yep, yep. Yeah. I heard a lot of beeping yeah. on the YouTube comments. How are people going? Hi, Nick. He goes, woo. Agreed. <laughs> Chet N, she says, survived. That's great. Carolyn says, love it. Yay. I'm so excited. Are there any questions? I guess everyone's doing okay. I had to tie my shoe. Do you have any questions, Michael? Man, I have so many questions, but nothing that we can answer in this podcast or in this live stream. In this live stream. So, um, I think we're doing pretty good. Nick says, uh, oh, it's actually Susan. Hi, Susan. Thanks for joining us. So, um, I think if we want, I could continue into my half breaks. Does that sound yes, good? Yes, please. That'd be great. All right. So, man, I really love half breaks, you guys. I don't know if 
may, that might be a new thing, but I really, I really do love half breaks. Let's see. <laughs> Susan says, waving. Lucia, great here, surviving and loving it. Awesome. Good to hear. I just want to make sure nobody's like sinking. Um, okay, so the half break in the shim sham, that usually goes eight, one, two, a three, four, five, six, a seven, eight. And honestly, the way that I would variate, variate? Yeah, the way that I would variant, variate this step is normally I would add a shuffle in with my foot. But I feel like that's a, a very common variation. So I want to offer another thing I came up with. And it's still quite rhythmic. We're going to have a knee slap. Eight, one, and I'm going to slap my right knee. A two and three. Now the important thing there is that the slap of my hand is actually going to come before count two. Eight, one, a two, a three. Eight, one, a two, a three. Eight, one, a two. And so I want you to practice for just a little bit, almost like your knee is a, is a puppet knee. And the slapping of the top of your knee is what ejects your foot. So, <laughs> So it's eight, one, a two. The, the climax or the extension of your kick is still on count two, but the knee slap is on the a uh before the two. Eight, oh. one, a two, a three. So after I kick two, I finish that with a ball change, just like the way the half break normally goes. Um, let's try that slowly a couple of times together. Five, six, seven, eight, one, a two, a three. Uh, ooh, ba, da, ba, ba. Eight, one, a two, a three. Now, even though I'm saying count two, you have to imagine in your brain that the kick makes a sound, when in fact, your kick does not make a rhythm or a sound. But in your soul, in your spirit, you have to feel that sound. So you're still imagining uh uh kita uh 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 kita uh uh Does that make sense? That's cool. That's I'm a gonna cool face... rhythm. I like that. Oh thanks, Michael Jagger. So I'm gonna face this way. Let's do that um two times. A ready cool. a five, a six, a five, six, seven, eight, one, e and the two. Uh, 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 uh. Now from here, can we try to add my break into it? Again, we got to turn around. Eight, one, kick, cross, turn, five, six, and seven. And uh, even though it was an option to snap when I first presented this break, I would highly recommend snapping on count six just to help you keep your timing. So let's do the two half breaks with Evita's turning break, nice and slow. Cool. Oh, New York City cars, five, mm. a six, a five, six, seven, eight, one, e and a two. Uh, uh. Eight, one, two, three, four, a five, six, and seven. Eight, one, e and a two. Uh, uh. Eight, one, two, three, turn, uh-huh, snap, and back. Ooh. Ooh. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. Yep, yep, yep. yep, yep. yep, yep. So just for our brain practice, is it alright if I ask us to go back to the tacky Annie variation that I had where we had tacky, Annie, toe, heel, toe. Then we're going to do the yeah. break and then we're going to go into my rhythmic knee slap. Yep, yep, yep. We got cool. this nice and slow and easy. Five, tacky Annie, five, six, seven, and eight. One, two, three, toe, heel, and out. A twice, uh, a boot, boot, boot. Last time, one, two, three, four, five, six, break. Eight, one, two, three, four, five. And eight, one, e, and a two. A, e, be, da, be, do. Break, boo, ba, boo, ooh, a, and eight, ooh, a, ba, ba, a, e, a, boo, 
boo ba ba do ba. I think we're yeah, okay. Yeah, that's cool. I think we made it. <laughs> that's great. Check. Thanks, Michael. I'm going to check into the comments and check in on you. Yeah, yeah. <gasps> James For says, me, that was working the right on it all. Of challenge, so it's good. James, he says, working on it all and having all the fun. <gasps> all well, the good. Fun. All the fun. There's a lot of fun to be Save having. some for us, James. Save some for us. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but in New York City, it's so hot, and I turned off the fan and the AC, so... How ooh, hot is it? We got we to gotta, we gotta get through this, Michael. Otherwise, I'm going to melt. It's so hot. Cool. Well, um, I've got a... Uh, let me do my half-break step for you. You can take a minute. You can... Uh, you can just sit there and man the comments. And uh, uh, re really quick, though, James had a question. <laughs> yep. He says, uh, "So it is two kickball break and then the full break." That is correct, James. Within the half break, we do that little idea two times through because those half breaks are half as long. So it's uh, do do knee slap ba do uh, uh knee slap ba do do the break o oh, turn around. Do it all again. A e knee slap ba do ba boo knee slap ba do. Yes, very good. Mm -hmm. Take it away, Michael, while I drink some water. <laughs> Please do. Well, what's funny is that we didn't confer on our steps before before now. So, um, what's great about our half breaks, uh, I think, is that we both were inspired by knee slaps. Um, it could be confusing. It could be great. But I'm going to use that same uh, same knee slap concept in a slightly different way. So I'm going to show you just from the front uh, very quickly, and then I'll reverse it so that you can follow along. But the idea is that we're going to slap on eight, one, uh, three, four, five, a seven. Holding, there's a base line that even slap, step, hold, ball, change. I'll step out to the side. So this is five, six, seven, eight, one, two, a uh, three, four, five, six, a uh, seven. Yeah, Michael. Five. Michael, say all of that for us just just again. Just do it again because we got a little choppy on your sound. Ah, okay, very good. Um, this is a slap on the right leg. On count eight to begin with. A five, six, seven. Slap, step, ball change. Step, step, ba da. So I'm doing that little rhythm there. Um, slap, who, ba do. Slap, who, ah, ba do. Um, and I put a hold after the step before the ball change, and I'm crossing behind myself. So as you go, slap, step down, and put your weight onto that foot. This is the right foot. And then what I'm going to do is cross behind with my left. Ba -doom. So I'm just going to cross behind and then step out to the side to get prepared to slap the other knee. Slap, step, hold, cross the right behind, and step out. So this is five. Six, a five, six, seven, slap, step, hold, and cross. Slap, step, hold, cross, two. Yes? And then from this moment, we only do that twice, we're going to go into our full break, which is step, tap, triple step, touch, step, touch, step. And then we repeat. Slap, step, hold, ball change. Slap, step, hold, ball change. Break, tap, triple step, tap, step, Tap, step. Does that make sense? I, I really like that, Michael. You know what I like so much about it is that the knee slap, it's a rhythmic sound, but we have to hold our balance. A, uh, a three, four, five, a seven. And then on this eight, instead of holding again, we have to go right into the attack of the break. I love it. I think that's so cool. On, then. So we do it one more time with a little bit more uh, flow without, yep. without all the stopping. Hey, ho, uh, here we go. We'll slap, step, ba -do. Slap, step, break, step, break, tap, triple step, touch, step, touch, step, ho, oh, ha, ba -do. ha, ba -do. ba -do. break, boom, triple step, ha, oh, ah, ha, ah, ah. ha. Yeah. A little bit of funky, funky. I like it. Funky, One more funky. time, please. Okay. Hey, ho, uh, here we go. A slap, step, ball change, step, slap, ball change, break, tap, triple step, 
touch step, do it again. Ba do a ho, ba do ha o do 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 a boo a boom. Man, that is so cool. After uh oh, after doing it the second time, I have to like stop myself. After we do the break step, a one yeah. triple step touch touch. It's right here. I have to go. I have to remember to slap my knee. <laughs> yes, yeah, slow your roll a bit. Cool. So that's my that's my variation on that half break step. Knee slaps, but in a slightly different expression of it. That's great. Is that everything? What are we missing? Oh, the boogie well, forwards, boogie forwards, and all that that fun stuff, right? Yeah. 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 You want uh, you want me to do my boogie for? It's super simple. Yeah, go for it. All right. So uh, I'm gonna face you just so you can see the styling of it, and then I'll face the other way so you can make sure that you're on the correct foot. Um, we've just done, basically before I even get into the transition of it, I just want you to step. Bring a knee in, boom, boom, boom. So I just go step in, step in, step in, step in. Oh, it's that's just a little fun. bit of a, a little bit of a, a knee in thing. So I feel, I feel like a rock star when um, I'm doing this. A one, I believe, will probably because it'll come after the break. A one, two, a three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five. Six, seven. But we need to do, sorry, Evita, riddle me this. We need a boogie back variation first, don't we? Oh, That's maybe, yeah. Maybe, yeah. That's my variations <laughs> on the boogie forward. My apologies. That's why that felt different than what I was used to. Even better, boogie backs are going to be replaced with a fish tail. Oh, so easy. We so, got that. We got that. We'll just use a different jazz step. So, when we do our a little fish tails here, it's like I got a little fish tail. I'm gonna step back with the uh, 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 step back with the right foot. We're gonna go right, left, right, left. And then we do knee in and knee out and knee in and knee out. That's right. Oops, we lost your sound, Michael. Hmm, I don't know, but I could talk for us. Nope, it might come back. Well, I'm gonna wait while we while we figure out how that comes back. Uh, not a problem. Don't panic, everybody. Don't panic. We've been doing so well for like a whole hour. <laughs> Um, I can take us, I can take us through this. So, uh, Michael's break, Michael's break was eight, one, triple step, four, five, six, seven, eight. We need to wait. So our fish tails go back on right foot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then we've got our boogie forwards, knee in, eight, oh, one, two, uh, three, four, uh, five. Six and seven. Yep, yep, yep. That was perfect. Michael, you came back. How did you come back? I think my headphones just decided to take a nap for a second. They were tired from all these crazy variations. My apologies. I bet. I bet. All right. Well, we're back to you. Let's do it one more time with you you leading us. That was perfect as you did it, but we'll, yeah, here I go. Five, six, a fish tail back, and a one, two, a three, four, a five, six, a seven, eight, one, two, three. Three, four, five, six, fish tail, one, a three, a five, a seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right. Yeah. Golden. Let me show you mine really quick. Yeah, um, do it. So uh, one of the ideas that I wanted to play with, um, there's a very famous documentary called The Spirit Moves. And a lot of us people who have been dancing Lindy Hop for a long time consider it like one of our Bibles of the dance. And there's a beautiful section where we see Al Mins and Leon James doing a version of the Shim Sham. In fact, there's a lot of uh, routines and lessons online that you can learn their version of the Shim Sham. 
But for this uh, boogie back, I just want to do a shout out to Leon James, where we really see him shuffle back. He puts his hands in front of himself and he kind of takes on this posture almost as if like someone were going to pull his hips back and he shuffles his feet back. So a one, a two, a three, a four, a five, a six, a seven. Yeah. And technically speaking, you could take this as fast as you want. You could add shimmies to your shoulders if you want. You could wiggle your fingers. You could pretend that somebody is blowing you away or pulling you back. But I want to use that as my variation for boogie backs. Um, bend your knees, wiggle your hips a little bit, put your arms in front of you, show your beautiful hands and fingers. And we've got an eight count of this. A five, a six, seven, eight, a one, a two, a three, a four, a five, a six, a seven, okay? Now for my boogie forward variation, what I wanna do is uh, similar to Michael, except I wanna kick my leg across. Michael had his knee coming in and then he stepped. Mm. I'd like to take my right leg and kick it across my body step, across my body step, across my body step. And so the illusion that I'm going for is kind of a slinky, diagonal, stretchy feel. And that would be with my right leg kicking across my body on count eight. So that would go a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, a three, four, a five, six, and seven. Leon James, a one, a two, a three, a four, a five, a six, a seven, eight, a one two, a three, four, a five, six, a seven. Yeah. And I'm definitely, um, with, uh, with the Leon James shuffling back, I'm definitely exposing my hands and making that part of the step. And then with my boogie forwards, I'm definitely lifting my arms up so I can get as much of a stretch and a long, a long kick as possible. And that's my variation on the boogie back and boogie forward. So, oh. Michael, do we think we can do your entire shim sham and then my entire shim sham with our variations? I have one question for you, Evita, while you're dancing. Um, do you have a variation on your shorty George coming forward or are you just going to do the, the back and forward? Oh, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I think for my variation on the shorty George, I'm just going to half time it or I'm going oh, cool. to do it in a different beat. So normally our Shorty George, normally the Shorty George would go eight and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think I'm gonna do something, I don't know, strange, like eight and one, two, and three, four, five, and six, seven. Those were, I guess, triplets, maybe, I hope. Big old <laughs> triplets, I think, uh, of some sort. So I'm slowing down my Shorty George instead of hitting or walking on every beat, eight and one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm gonna mm -hmm. hit eight and one, two, and three, four, five, and six, seven. Booch, ba, boo, ba, boo. Yeah, that's what I'm gonna do. That's funky, funky, I like it. <laughs> so, um, while we're here with me, should I do my shim sham? Yes, yes, we should. And then once we're done uh, surviving and thriving through yours, I'll show you my shorty George variation, which is actually a different jazz step altogether. And then we can do mine all together. So oh, let's rock I'm sorry. yours out. Are you sure, Michael? Let's see your yeah, shorty George. Yeah. Nah, 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 nah. Let's do it. Let's do you, baby. Let's do you. Oh, okay, okay. Okay. Well, I'm just, okay. I'm just gonna get through it. So. Here we are. Our first chim sham step is going to start with the kicks. I'll take it nice and slow and easy so I can hopefully call out things to you. A five, a six, a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, and three, kick across and out. Eight, a one, two, and three, four, a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, and three. Four and five, six, seven, turn. One, two, three, four, a five, and seven. Push is one, two, three, four, turn five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, a three, four, a five, six, seven, eight, a one, two, and three, four, and five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, and eight. Tacky Annie, toe, heel, uh, 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 and eight. A one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. A one, two, three. Here comes the break. Five, six, seven. Turning one, two, three, four, a five, six, and seven. Eight, knee, a slap, ba, ba, da, dee, ba, 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 ba. Turning break, do, ba, do, ba, da, ba. Eight, one, e, and a two, ba, do, be, da, ba, boo. And a one, two, three, four, a five, six, and seven. A one. And then, if that were the second round of the shim sham, we would go into shuffle back, shuffle back. Five, six, seven, kick it front. Ah, uh, five again, we go shuffle back. Five, six, seven, kick it front. Mm. And then again, shuffle back. A one, two, three, four, shorty George. Eight, a one, two, and four. Bye, bye. <laughs> there's something there, there's something there. How are we doing? April, hello. April says, nice variations. Love how clear and understandable your instructions are. Thank uh, you. We try, you. we try. Um, cool, let's take a look then. Oh, let's see, Nicole had a question. Hi, Avita, with the shuffles back, is it right or left? Nicole, I think I'm going right, left, right, left, right, left but it's okay if it were the other foot, you can kind of fumble it as you need. But I think I'm going right, left, right, left, right, left. Yeah, cool. James loves okay. it. <laughs> hmm. And um, I think we're ready. Michael, we should learn yours. Super simple. Um, I'm gonna just simply replace the Shorty George with a truck and step. So. Um, it's another jazz step that I really enjoy and it just progresses forward. So it kind of, for me, it ticked the box of, of, uh, being able to move forward with it. So a truck and step for us is, um, is just to break down a, a truck and very quickly, uh, I'm going to step forward onto my right foot and I'm showing on a profile because I'm going to keep my weight towards the heel step. And then I'm going to straighten the leg. And as I straighten the leg, I lift the toe. So I go, uh, 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 uh. Ooh, ah, uh, step, heel, boom, ah. Uh. So this is the basic of a trucking. The weight sits in the middle or the back of the foot so that you get step, boom, ah, uh, ah, uh, boom, ah, uh, boom. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So the toe tap is on the even beat. And then as I do this, I step in and then I fan the foot out. A one, two, three, four, five. Or you can go a one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So you have the ability to either start on eight or uh, sorry, an even beat or an odd beat. Um, it doesn't, I don't think it matters. Um, but the other thing that I, uh, that I do is I have a truck and finger, which is apparently it simulates uh, the dancing waiters um, who would work uh, in, in performing like kind of like dinner theater. Uh, and they would spin a tray on their finger. So this kind of imitates that gesture. <laughs> that's a trick and you, finger. You can and then pretend I take that the, you're I spinning that a right. tray. And then the left back of the wrist is kind of on my hip so that I get this idea. But, um, and there's a little bit of a lean as well. So I step into it. Fish, tail, fish, tail, and one, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, one, a three, a five, a seven, eight, one, two, three. You can step on eight or one, but that's the, that's going to be my variation to progress us forward instead of a shorty George. That's beautiful, Michael. So, um, are you ready to take us through your entire shim sham? <laughs> Maybe. I guess we have to, don't we? Yeah. Whether I'm you ready know, or an, not. An, another thing. Oh, I was just going to say another thing for those of you watching, um, our apologies, we, we have not used any music in this session because uh, we're concerned about getting muted out by Facebook or YouTube for playing music. But of course, as you know, the Shim Sham can be done to a lot of standard uh, songs. And so you're just going to have to deal with our counting and singing and scatting. Um, 
Also, another interesting thing, as much as Michael and I would love to do the Shim Sham side by side together with our variations, we're going to be out of sync. So Michael, Mike, yeah. Michael, maybe you and I can video ourselves doing it to a song and we can like put ourselves side by side doing our variations. We could do that later, oh, like on our own time. Okay. All right, then. I like it. I love video projects. I know you do. Okay. You know I do. All right. Let's okay. try to stumble through mine and, and remember what comes next. And uh, I'm excited. You should be too. We're going to start. Remember that we have this little toe heel for our first shim sham step. And then the for the pushes, we have the heel toe variations. And then our tachyani is just triple steps behind ourselves. And then our half break is knee slap, butto, knee slap, butto. So that's just a quick, a quick reminder before we get into it. Um, it still may make a mistake, but don't give up. Hey, ho, here we go. Eight, one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. To the left, to the right. You double up on the left. You go the right, the left, double up. Here's the break step, tap, triple step. Touch, step, touch, step, heel, heel, toe, toe, heel, heel, toe, toe, and scuff, and cross, slide, left foot, a da, ba, da, and scuff, cross, line, slide, a da, 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 ba, da, ba, da, ba, da, ba, do, ah, 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 ooh, ah, 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 ooh, ha, and a triple step, triple step, five, a six, step, stomp off, triple step, triple step, triple step, Step, stomp off, and triple step, triple step. Here's our break. Step, tap, triple step, touch, knee slaps, go. Eight, slap, ball change, eight, a slap, break, step, touch, hoo. Full step, touch, step, knee, a slap, knee, slap, badu, knee, slap. The break, step, ah, uh, step, touch, step, touch, step, fish, tail, ho. Huh? Huh? Oh, Michael forgot what his, what's my, uh, what's my boogie forward, Evita? My boogie forward is, um, is knees. There it is, Michael. So one more time, just from the, from the fishtails back. My apologies. Here we go. We've just done it twice through. It was amazing. We've just finished our break. Let's fishtail. Hey, ho, here we go. A fishtail. Who? A five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, five, knee in, eight, two, three. Now we fish tail back again, fish tail, and we truck it out and in, ah, who, who, ah, do it again, and who, ah, I do, ah, 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 and who, ah, 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 do, 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 do. Well, Evita, I couldn't even get through my own step, but. We were close. You were great. You were great. That was fine. That was fine. Um, that is, man, it's already been an hour and almost 15 minutes, so I don't think we should Ooh. hold captive the viewers any longer. But how cool was this? We got two different variations of the Shim Sham, and those of you watching cool. at home can pick and choose whatever you like. They're all interchangeable because uh, we all honor the break step on our right foot on count eight. Um, also, if you were to do the Shim Sham, maybe the first go around, you could do my variations and the second go around, you could do Michael's variations. So there's a lot of possibilities here. Um, and I think Michael, I think this is material that we can add into our member, uh, our membership on Syncopated City. That's a good idea. That is a good idea. Yeah. It's beautiful. <laughs> Um, and yeah, oh, Jenin, thank you. She says you are both amazing. Thank you. Thank you. I'd missed you. And I'm happy to see that you're dancing. Um, thank you, James, for being with us. Kristen, oh my gosh, April, Terry, thank you all so very much. Um, this video is going to stay up on Facebook and YouTube. So if you want to share it with anybody or watch it again, feel free. And, uh, Thanks for playing with us. <laughs> uh, yeah, I really, I think really uh, just my, my two cents for what it's not worth. Um, it's what was really fun for me in, in terms of tackling this exercise that you put forth, Avita, was really just thinking about uh, 
thinking about a structure, which is the shim sham, and then how we can create steps or variations on something. It's a really good exercise just to go through for any of us. And you can do that with a myriad of, of ideas. So um, this really pushed me in a fun way. And I really appreciate that you put that forward. So thank you. Well, we got to keep pushing each other. We can't, we can't give up. We got to keep going, right? Never give up, never give in. Um, <laughs> one other thing I want to mention, Avita, a little surprise kind of teaser for next week. I may have wangled uh, an up and coming young dancer who Are one day will become a big deal. Are you sure you want to say anything? Is, should I not? Should I just leave it at that? I'll just tease. I think, I think you gonna... should leave it at that. I think you should leave it at that because what if something happens and our special guest next week can't show up? So I think you I should just tell everybody we have a super, super special guest that we think is going to play with us next week. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So we'll leave it at that as a teaser. All right. Thank you, everybody. Well, thank you. And thank you, thank I'm going to find the off switch. <gasps> this is the pull the plug now. <laughs> Bye, everybody. Bye, Michael. Thanks for playing with me. Bye. Thank you.